Welcome back, folks, and thank you for watching Inside the Valley and sticking with us on this Sunday morning. I hope you all are having a fantastic weekend. Joining us now, we are talking about Texas Valley Sports. We are joined by Jose Perales. You are the CEO. We have Joe Perez, or Joe Perez and Alex Sainz. You know, you're both quarterbacks. Is that correct? Right. Awesome. So tell us a little bit about Texas Valley Sports. We spoke about you being on the show just a few months ago. So tell us a little right. bit about... Yeah, Texas Valley Sports, uh, we're, we're men's tackle football. Uh, anyone who's 18 and older can play. Uh, and we have teams all the way from Rio Grande all the way to Brownsville. So it's, it's caught fire over these last two years. You know, football is, is very much loved in the Valley. Most definitely. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, we're, <laughs> we're making it happen. We're, we're having lots of games, lots of communities coming out. It's great. Wow. So tell me in the past few months how things have maybe grown a little bit or shown more interest from the public or anything that's kind of, you know, pushed you towards that next kind of level. Well, we see a lot of uh, community support. Mm -hmm. um, we've had uh, the military. We've had capable kids. Um, a lot of organizations, our sponsors, Pueblo Tires, uh, uh, Rodeo Dental, and uh, Doctor's Choice Rehab. Mm -hmm. Everybody's just coming together and, and really trying to trying to get this to take off with us. So it's, it's been great. Awesome. And yeah. I know you guys have some playoff games coming up. So that's towards the end of the season obviously right yes uh the playoffs will start august 4th okay um and they'll last throughout the whole month of august uh, our games are every weekend on saturdays and sundays and those are going to be just some really high action-packed games awesome yes. now, joe and alex both of you did you play in high school did you how long have you been playing with texas valley sports kind of tell me a little bit about both of you yeah well i played in donna high i graduated in 2015. okay and I've been playing in this league. Last year was the first year I started the first year, and mm -hmm. this is my second year. Awesome. I graduated from Donna North High School in okay. 2017, and um, this is my first year playing for Texas Valley Sports. Awesome. And so how did you guys kind of hear about Texas Valley Sports? Well, it was like a, on a Facebook ad. Oh, and I really? I saw it, and I was like, let me, check this, let me check this out, and mm -hmm. it actually turned out to be a pretty good thing. Oh. Well, when I was in high school, the, it was already going on. Okay. So I kind of like started seeing what I wanted to do for fun mm -hmm. when I would graduate when I, during school of course yeah. during college so I kind of keep that competitive in me every Saturday or Sunday and yeah I keep having sure. fun so, yeah. I know I'm sure both of you played throughout high school all four years so I'm sure going from right. playing almost every day that's your you know constant yeah. thing that you're thinking about too then absolutely going. and these guys actually are rivals uh, from high oh, school okay <laughs> they went to rival <laughs> high schools and everything and they can keep it going now here with yeah. Texas Valley Sports awesome in fact um their game is next Sunday, not not uh, not today Sunday. The next following Sunday, they actually play against each other. So wow, that'll be a game okay. to go watch. Definitely. Yeah. So how do you split up teams? Does it go depending on where they're from, or do you kind of just do a lottery where you just spread them out into different areas or to try out? Yeah, we're very careful. We we, we always want to have the right coaching staff in place mm -hmm. um, and the right location. We don't want to have two teams uh, in the same city. Right. But yeah, we're very selective uh, in that process. But then, you know, it's usually that they sign up for what's closest to them. Okay. So, so that they yeah. can. Awesome. So, where do you have, and what cities or areas do you have teams at the moment? Right now, we have teams in Rio Grande, Palm View, okay. uh, McAllen, mm -hmm. Far, Donna, um, Alamo, Harlingen, and Brownsville. Wow. So, is there any hopes into expanding any further? Any more cities? Any, you know? We, we actually are open to that. Uh, we actually have a lot of people in different cities wanting to sign up. Really? Yeah, and I forgot Edinburgh as well, but we also have like La Feria now wanting to get in, mm -hmm. Rio Hondo. Um, even in Willacy County, people are starting to contact me. So awesome. it's, it's gonna grow. That's cool, most definitely. So how? So again, those games are what's coming up and then that'll kind of be the end of the season then? Right, the end of the season will be at the end of this month. Okay. And August 4th, we begin the playoffs. I hope everybody can go out there. Awesome. And then once playoffs are over, when does the next kind of season start up as far as maybe people signing up or wanting to join and all that? Yeah, in September, uh, they can go to our website, which is www.texasvalleysports.com. Awesome. And in September, uh, you can register to sign up for a team, mm -hmm. and you know, you'll be invited to tryouts and everything. So. Awesome. We Super. start right away after the season. Super exciting. So can people follow you on Facebook? Is there anything that they can keep up to date? So if they want to attend one of these playoff games or if they want, just want to keep up to date with you all on regular games, um, anywhere they can go to kind of follow you on? Absolutely. Besides our website, you're right. Facebook, uh, we're at TexasValleySports.com. It's very easy to find us. Um, but all the teams have their own pages as well. Awesome. So you can find the Alamo Predators with Alex Science here and then also the Donna Aztec with Joe Perez. Cool. That sounds really interesting. Hopefully, you know, you guys grow to more cities. It sounds like you guys already have a good 
kind of stable, you know, yes. overview of the valley, which is really good. Awesome, but it's Absolutely. a great way for, you know, people to come on out, want to continue playing, that, you know, Absolutely. stay involved and active. Absolutely, yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Well, thank you all three for so much for coming on the show. I really appreciate it. Sounds good. And good luck in your playoff games. Thank you. Thank you. Hopefully you guys do well. I know you guys play against <laughs> each other, but good luck to both of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, folks. Well, that's going to do it for us on this Sunday. I hope you all had a great weekend, and we will see you next Sunday. Have a good day.